Welcome to the installation video of Plex Block Set on a Mac computer. First, go to www.plexm.com using a web browser of your choice. Once you're there, hover your mouse over the download button and select Plex Block Set from the drop down menu. Click on the appropriate installation file and wait for the file to download. In this video, I have downloaded the installation file to my desktop. Double click on the installation file. Next, drag the Plex folder into the Applications folder like so. If you have an administrator password on your computer, click Authenticate and type it in. After Plex finishes copying, open the Plex block set folder and double click on the Plex application within it. Click Open, and click Continue to start with the installation wizard. If you already have a Plex license, please fast forward to the time mark displayed on the screen. If you don't have a license yet and would like to request a 30-day trial license or a one-year student license, select the option Request License and click Continue. Please keep in mind that, in order to obtain a one-year student license, you need to have gotten a student code from your professor in your university. If your professor doesn't have a student code list from us, please have them reach out to us at info at plexem.com. Select the desired license type and product in this window and click Open Web Form. This will bring you to a web page where we ask you to provide your contact information. Once you fill this out, Click Submit and look out for an email containing the license file from Plexum. Once you receive that license file, you may then follow the next steps in this video. If you have already received the license file in an email from Plexum, go back to that email and copy the license file to your computer. In this video, I have copied it to my desktop. Click Browse and navigate to wherever you saved the license file to. In this case, it's the desktop. Select the license.lic file and click Open. Keep in mind that the Use Plex Viewer License option is free and allows the user to simulate, but not modify, Plex models as long as they were created by users with a full version of Plex block set. This option could be used to share your models with your colleagues, customers, and suppliers. To delete a Plex Viewer license, please refer to the link displayed on the screen. Click Continue to set up your MATLAB search paths. The MATLAB search path window allows you to edit the startup.m file, which will set your MATLAB paths to the folders displayed on the screen automatically. Click Continue, and click Done. Now start MATLAB, and go to the Set Paths window. You can do this by clicking on the Set Paths button at the top of the screen in the newer versions of MATLAB. Check that the paths to the Plex and Plex slash demos folders are listed. If they aren't there, add the folder displayed on the screen to your path and restart MATLAB. Once the paths are all set, type Plex lib into the MATLAB command window and press Enter. This will load and start the Plex toolbox within Simulink for you. This concludes our installation video of Plex block set on a Mac computer. For more information on the installation process, please visit our website at www.plexem.com slash support slash installation underscore help. Please also check out other videos on various topics of using Plex. Thanks for watching.